I want her to stop barking and then she won't go after me. When he first got Bella, he was working a lot of nights and weekends, so a lot of the responsibility fell upon myself. Come on, stop it! Bella is a little bit much for Kathy to walk. Are you kidding me? Come on, stop! She'll jump on people, jumps on furniture. Bella's jumping the gate. No, no! Jesus! Bella, that's my dog, Bella. Bella, just... Let me go Bella. Bella, just... Having Victoria come to the house and experience the chaos that we have here is kind of embarrassing. So this is a family room where you want where to hang out? Where we're supposed to sit as a family. Right. You know, we have a nice big house. <laughs> <where we're... laughs> and this is what takes place when that happens. Bella's going to jump the gate. This is a recurring theme. Yes. Yeah. I don't blame her, because why would you want to sit here with this? No, that's not why she jumped at the gate. Oh, that's ridiculous. There are so many problems in this household that if I had years, I still don't think I could get through them all. You brought Bella into the home without seeing if these two would get on, which is, I have to say, and I want to say it right now, highly irresponsible. It's totally self-serving. You bought this dog because you wanted it, and you didn't take the time to see if your existing dog would be able to cope with another dog coming. I want you to change dogs. I'm going to take Charlie, OK, whilst Hi. you take Bella. Good luck. This is Oliver's dog, and why am I walking her? It's Oliver's responsibility to walk Bella. Because you Relax. walk Bella, don't you? Yeah. I want to see how I, that I is. I walk Bella more than Oliver oh, does. OK. I, I walk Bella every day. OK. OK. Kath. Kath. Do you know she does this every day? She doesn't walk her every day. At, but whenever Bella she walks her, I'm at sure. Night, when you're working at night. Oh, Bella, like. come here. My stress level is extremely anxious knowing the possibilities of being dragged around the entire neighborhood and half the time looking like a fool. I'm going to give Bella a harness so that she doesn't pull you. Right. It's going to make walking a lot easier, a lot more ple pleasurable for you. Kathy needs to have help from her family. She needs to have more support from Oliver. She needs to have more support from her kids. Why does it make you feel when your mom says Bella should go? It makes me feel upset because I really love her. Your mother is trying to keep everybody happy. And it puts a lot of stress and a lot of pressure on her. So here's where you come in. I want you to help your mom as much as possible. So you, because you're old enough, are going to be a really important part in this whole process. Why don't you go get your mom down here? I think it would be good to work as a team, not like as my dog or her dog. I feel like how you're angry sometimes. Right. And stressed out. Right, okay. Are you I gonna help her? understand how you're like, stressed out all the time, and just know that I'm here to help you go through it. Oh, mm. thank you. I appreciate that. I couldn't that. put it any other way what these two said. All right, thank you. I appreciate that. I think it made Kathy feel really good having her children say they understand and not blame her for everything that's going on inside this house. Because she's a great mommy. I can see that, isn't mm -hmm. she? And you're great kids. I want to show you this. Wow. Right. Oh my God. You've got a lot of baby gates around your home, and I understand why you have them. It's one that you don't have to walk over. Wow. You'll be able to walk through. Amazing. Right. Holy cow. Now, I've done two of them one here and one there. So I want this to be either Bella or Charlie's safe zone. Okay. Both the dogs need to have their safe zone where they feel safe from the other. So Bella's will be this one, Charlie's will still be upstairs because he relaxes upstairs. Right. right. This is a place where hopefully she won't be able to jump over or knock these over. I want to take away some of the family's baby gates so there aren't so many in the household, but the ones that there are there are going to be solid, taller, and they're going to contain the dogs in their respective spaces so that they're safe. Bella needs a safe zone, Charlie needs a safe zone, and his space as well. So give that to both dogs. 
you need your safe zone and you need your space as well so you can operate as a family together. I need to get Thanks. Kathy more comfortable around Bella. Now she's a big puller, she really is, and she pulls more with you than she does with you. So I want to see if this harness is going to help her. I definitely don't trust Bella as a dog. Everybody tells me she's such a kind, loving dog, but she doesn't really act that way when I walk her. I like to have a nice loose leash when I'm walking her, but as soon as she walks too fast for me, I pull back on the leash and I stop. What I'm going to do is we're going to turn around and then you're going to take over this, OK? My stomach was very nervous. See? Oh, God. All right. I am pulled all over the place with Bella. You take over, come to this side. Am I 100% convinced that it's going to work? I'm not there yet. Back. Here. Kathy's terrified of walking with Bella because she's had some bad experiences, but I really need to change that. So no pressure on the throat at all. Come on, let's go. Good. Good job. Go for it. Come on. Good girl, Boy. Bella. How does that feel? Good. Nice, good. Yeah, I don't want you pulling, I don't want you wrenching, nothing. Remember, all of this training is about getting those dogs to think. So let her think about it. The leash is relaxed now pretty much looks like. Now let her go, go or what if no, I no, want to go? No, no, you tell oh, her okay. when we're going, when you're going. Let's go. I'm starting to feel more comfortable walking Bella. Am I totally comfortable? No. But it is working, making me feel more comfortable with Bella. Bella, sit. Good girl. Very good. After a slow start, Bella got the hang of it, and so did Kathy. And they had a successful walk together where Kathy was in control. Lots of love. You're a brilliant Bye -bye. family. Bye-bye. Thank you. See you. Bella's, you know, her ability to walk with Kathy is, it was really surprising. Not dragging her down the block. Kathy's more confident with her, and it's, it's really cool to see her be able to walk Bella without, you know, being freaked out. Good girl. See? You're a good girl. Yeah. Definitely. You can handle her. Right. No, it's I'm not, not afraid of her. I am very impressed with our dog, Bella. Yes, it's nice to hear you call her our dog. Come here, give me some. <laughs>